Okay, so welcome back. Hello. We have decided to just continue on a little bit past where we had our last crash. Yes, they figured out what was wrong though, right? Yeah, the the issue is pretty simple. Uh, some of the lore got cleaned up and streamlined, but one of the um, one of the unlock flags didn't get uh, removed properly, and so it tries to unlock something that's not there anymore. Hmm. Um, so uh, just. That'll little, do it. Little polished details. That'll do it. All sorted out. Fortunately, there's a preset that's still in the game that I can load up that's just past that. So we've only missed a little bit of story. We walked out, said hi, we saw that thing, and then uh, Schneider, yeah. Lucas, left us uh, saying that he had needed to go do some things and that it wouldn't really be you know, that much fun to play with a high-level player anyway. Uh, not a whole lot of challenge in that. And so he suggested that Emily and I... Or Emily and Leah start a party party together. So start a party. Let's start a party. So that's where we are. So Emily is going to follow us around and do stuff now. But, Yay! Uh, what we're going to do this time um, is essentially do chesting and questing in Rookie Harbor and Autumn's Rise. Uh, so we're going to go through all of the areas, all of the buildings, find all the chests, and do all the quests that are in this first area. Um, so, a bunch of side story type stuff. None of this is really required, but you can do it anyway. Uh, go and see options to buy things from stores. It's so funny because. Also, the same thing. I yep. don't remember you really using a lot of stuff. I don't. I don't. When I play, I don't actually use a lot of things. Right. You don't have to do it that way. Yeah. I probably would use a lot more items if I was yeah. into the game than he yeah, does. Yeah, it's, it's fairly flexible in that regard. All right. Let's go start it here. Yay. Mrs. Ms. Teak? Ms. Teak. <laughs> Ms. Teak. I just got it. Okay. <laughs> Hi. Oh, yeah, that's right. How did partner you should like a healthy gal who can appreciate a nice piece of meat? Huh? Ha <laughs> hmm. <laughs> <laughs> ha. I always sniff out good taste. It's like my special talent. The name's Selena Teak. <laughs> And I have grand plans to create the perfect steaks for everyone to enjoy. This is the main plot. Leah. No, it's just a side quest. Mm -hmm. yeah. At least that's what I want to do, but I still don't have the proper ingredients for that. And since I can't just leave the city and search for them, maybe you can help me with that. So. Wooden steaks. Wooden steaks. <laughs> that's a vampire joke. Yeah. <laughs> so. Mm. Girl, you are the best. It'll be amazing. You won't regret it. Anyway, I definitely need some nice raw meat, of course. The bovines and all and rice should do nicely. Though I heard you gotta have, like, a good rank to get some meat from them. Whatever that means. Hmm? Then I need some firewood that brings out the taste perfectly. I don't know much about the trees here, but best bring me some very light and also some sharp wood. You should find both of them on a mountain somewhere. Good luck <laughs> on a mountain. Somewhere. somewhere. On a mountain. Sure. Why not? Yeah. So we don't need to worry. She has a cowboy hat. Too much it's about just that one for that. now. noticed that. That's adorable. Yeah. I think they're going to put some art in for her at some I point. was going to say, because like, she looks like a generic sprite person. Yeah. But hopefully Pretty by the time generic. this comes out, it will be a little different. We have different. this in here. What's that? We found some lore. We're not really going to go through all the lore. Just you know, too much extra side but story. Guys, but guys, there's so much you could do. You need to explore and click yeah, on all the things. Definitely explore and click on all the things, because there's a lot to find in here. This video can possibly attempt to do everything. Yeah, we're going to try to do a lot in this series, but I'm not going to go through every every single bit of dialogue. So you can enjoy it and find it yourself. A seeker recruit? You better get your faction briefing at Seeker Central first before going sightseeing. Oh yeah, that's right, we wouldn't have done that yet. Let's do that mm. first. You can find the responsible official on the ground floor of that building. Mm. <laughs> yes, that's right. <laughs> what? Oh, this okay. is normally something that you would probably notice right when you walked out here. Oh! Is this thing showing? Ooh. And this is actually a useful way to see what's available. Oh. So you can see quests like a faction introduction, some first steps from a guy that's hanging out just outside the city, and this guy who's selling ice cream in the marketplace. It's amazing. They basically built um, a small-scale RPG, yeah. a legit RPG game, yeah, inside this fighting game and puzzle mm -hmm. game. Yeah, no, there's... It's pretty big. It's awesome. It gives you um, everything. And then this one that we just picked up. So, 
This is a good place to come if you're trying to figure out where the quests are. You can't accept the quests from this, but you can get started on where to go. Okay. And then this guy will tell us <gasps> more. Top hat. Greetings, Seeker. I see that you have completed the introduction to Operation Trackwalker. Thus, you are now also qualified to use your abilities as a Seeker to assist the four factions in their duties. Huh? They are organizations that secure humanity's survival and prosperity through their special fields of expertise. More detailed information can be accessed in the terminal behind you. Oh. For now, you should know that each faction is a subdivision in Rookie Harbor, like in every settlement. To better understand our society and your place in it, you should get introduced to all of them. For this purpose, I will now issue an official assignment. Please accept. Yay! Hooray! Accept. Mm. Good. Visit the representative of every faction in Autumn's Rise and introduce yourself. Most of them can be found in their respective headquarters, near the market or the Western interests. Though the HQ of the CTC is still inaccessible to new seekers, their ambassador can be found just outside this building. Once you've visited all of them, return to me to get your reward. Mm. Mm. I'm trying to think. I was realizing just as reading, so this isn't yep. important to the game. But like, if I'm reading out loud, like the exclamation point or yep. the question mark ellipses things, I sometimes I realize I read the exclamation ones as question sounding. Yeah, I just read it the way that you feel like they should okay. sound. Here's you know a bunch of random information, backstory-ish on all the stuff. Read that at your own pace. It's mm -hmm. it's not super important. Um, <laughs> but you know. All backstory kind of stuff. Sorry, I have a rubber duck here that I just got, and I love it. <laughs> and it's sitting next oh, to me. Oh, good day, Seeker. Ooh! Pleased to meet you. He's like, Mr. Norms. My name is Mr. Normsworth, <laughs> and I am a humble mediative employee of the local trading association. What? <laughs> Normsworth? Mr. Normsworth, yes. <laughs> that sounds like a great name for a cat, doesn't it? <laughs> yes, it does. Hello, Mr. Normsworth. Are you hungry today? Hello. Of course you are. Of course Yes, here's your food. Oh, good, Mr. Nonsworth. Yes. <laughs> you gobbled that up, you little thing. Oh. <laughs> Shall we continue? <laughs> yeah, hey, you meowed along with me. <laughs> I didn't say it wasn't funny. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's good. <laughs> keep going. Just keep... You're lying. Hi! Now, as you might have already assumed, a matter of my position has always been in brokering business agreements big and small. Thus, there is always a need for a helping hands, wanting to do some necessary legwork for a generous payment, of course. Excuse me. Ooh. <laughs> Just now, I have an unresolved assignment by the pub for a delivery of mixed food ingredients. It requires collecting raw materials in the wild, trading them for required items here in the market, and of course delivering them to my client. A rather simple task, fitting for the beginning of a lucrative relationship, I would say. Can I count on your cooperation? But of course. But of course, Mr. Nomsworth. <laughs> it's a deal, then. My client requires two fruit and veggie sets each, and also a precious spice set to boot. You can procure them right here on the central market near the fountain. For the exchange, you will need raw trading materials from the various plants of Autumn's Rise. Oh my gosh. So basically, it's a bunch of, there's a lot of fetch quests involved. Yeah, fetch quests. They kind of get more involved as you go, and you can, you can see what you've got in here. And... We'll leave that one off for now, but, like, we can flag these, and then we can cycle through them with Q and E. And, and it will know if you pick anything up yeah, in the it, wild. Yeah, like, well, the stuff that you need to pick up in the wild, for example, mm -hmm. uh, this quest specifically wants you to learn how to use the trading system. Oh. And so I can see that trade for a veggie set is some autumn leaves and twilight dew, oh. and a gold beetle and season apples for the fruit set, and a bear cicada and azure dragonfly for the spice set. So, um, and you know, all these guys have, have stuff to offer and trade for. So you can technically some buy everything more special you need from them, right? Or no? Um, or do you have to go in the wild? Kind of. Uh, some of the stuff, like the raw ingredients you need to go out and find. Okay. So... But let's continue on. Uh, I really want to squeak my rubber duck to the time of the music, but I won't do that. Welcome oh! to our garden, Seeker. I'm Manzana, the chief woodkeeper of this branch. I love that they've been making individual yes. sprites for everybody. Yeah, for a lot of the recurring characters or, you know, special NPCs, they've done some, some more detailed sprite work now. Yay! Uh, not all of those are finished yet, but the hope is they will all be ready. Or were they thinking the they would do them for the people that are, like, on the boat, too? Like, the ones that are like, ooh, Miss Avatar. I don't know if they're gonna get 
special sprites. Um, so they're incidentals that are kind of tutorial They're incidentals. Features. I mean, they, they have a little bit more lines, but I think the idea is they're just some they're crew members. Fair enough. So. Oh, yeah. Thanks. So, yes, I'm Manzana, the chief woodkeeper of this branch. It's always reassuring to have your kind supporting our fruitful endeavors. Mm -hmm. Hi. In fact, your appearance comes in a fortunate time, as we've noticed unrest brewing among the thickets of Autumn's Rise. Mm -mm. A sickness has befallen trees in different locations and threatens the balance of the track in the entire region. Ooh, that's not good. Would you be able to assist us in stemming it before it can cause widespread harm? Heck yes. Of course. Mm. Excellent. I will give you some bottles filled with concentrated and fermented juice made from the fruits of our garden. It's proven in the past to have a beneficial effect on the self-regulatory instincts of the track. Oh, nice. Use your instincts as a seeker to find the afflicted trees and treat them with the extract. Oh. It should suffice to cure the trees at this stage. Take care, young seeker. Nice. You're also standing really close to him. Which is amused me. Just... <laughs> right up in his business. Yeah, <laughs> yeah so <laughs> open. Like, all open. Emily, what are you doing? Hey. Stop bothering that man. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna run. Up here, actually. Because we need to do <gasps> some chest gathering, mm -hmm. too. Emily, where'd you go? I think she got lost. There oh. she is. <laughs> I love that. That's so convenient. Yeah, she has like an auto auto return on her. I love in that. In case she gets separated from you because I do a tricky jump or something. <laughs> they tried really hard to to uh, map all of the NPCs and particularly allies. Oh, I'm glad. That's cool. <laughs> you reached this spot. Not bad. No reason to hold back. Go claim your prize. Mm. Ho ho. <gasps> what is all that? Good work finding this spot. Did you know these refresher chests are instant for each player? Ah, it means I opened this treasure chest myself before. The content is replicated for each player. That's cool, right? No more annoying empty chest because some random player reached it before you. Ooh. Mm. Yeah, anyway, gotta meet my friends at the entrance. Bye. Thanks, bro. He's just... no, he's... I bet it's really annoying, like, working at those things, because you'll just hear, kuthum, kuthum. Hey! <laughs> They're not that thick, you know? They're just canvas. Yeah, a lot of these guys... Oh. They got what? stuck on each other, trying to... <laughs> <laughs> Looks like you met your friend, and you're just doing a weird uh, dance. There they go. They sort themselves out. <laughs> <laughs> uh, pathing. It's more amusing than it should be. Yeah. Hello there, young lady. Frosty Arnold. <laughs> Can I interest you in some cool and delicious ice cream? Woo! Mm-hmm. Well, unfortunately, we're out of stock right now. But if you bring me some fresh ice from Bergen Trail, I can quickly I produce like new ice cream. He needs to make a frustrated face when he says that. <laughs> that might be nice. We need to make a note of that and send that to the dudes and uh, be like, that please make her look annoyed yeah. when he says that. She has an annoyed face. Could you bring me some Bergen ice? About five should suffice. Sure thing. Heck yes. Great. <laughs> Great. Uh. All right. Oh, uh, you can find Bergen Ice in the snowy parts of Bergen Trail. Just continue to the west until you reach the mountain area. Did they seriously ask you to fetch ice from a distant mountain? What is this, the Middle Ages? <laughs> I like Sergei's little quip there. That's great. Yeah. Oh, this is you. Oh, yeah. Oh, what kind of voice do you want to do for her? I don't know, something sultry. <laughs> really? Okay. Yes. Hey, Seeker. Nice meeting some valiant fresh blood around here. Hi! I would love to do some bonding with a fellow explorer, but right now there's a problem with one of our jobs. Is she coming on to her? I the way I'm that's, reading it. That's though. always the way it sounded to me. <laughs> okay. Jukos has just finished a detailed geographical survey that's supposed to serve as the basis for future expeditions. Then he had to get jumped by wildlife and lose that storage unit with all his data, the careless klutz. So since you're here, could you help us out with that? A seeker should be more than qualified for that kind of task. <laughs> Feels so weird. <laughs> mm. Awesome. I'll transmit you the alleged location of the whole tobacco so you should be able to track the thing down. Just remember to mind your instincts as a seeker, and you'll be back here enjoying my company in no time. I know. <laughs> Uh, yeah, no, yeah, no, yeah, you're right. You see it, right? Oh, I see it. 
So there's that. Uh, we need to go collect some stuff down this way. So uh, down here, let's take a peek inside the info building, where we have. This is one of my favorite little side conversations. Just look at her go! I tell you, Miss Lee is the best girl! Dude, I heard you the first hundred times. Still don't get it. She's just some one-note tutorial NPC. <laughs> Actually, she gets fleshed out nicely in the tie-in graphic novels that center around her adventures. Is Miss Lee the... Oh, that's She's her. She's done. What? What else is there? Mr. Nomsworth Middle Management Miracles? Oh, hey, her growth as a fighter and the final confrontation with her corrupted father had me on the edge of my seat. Miss Lee, is that the one that's... And now she fights a sandbag all day. What a perfect character arc. Oh, 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 okay. It's Shush, my girl earned this piece. <laughs> fans. Yeah. Oh, fans. Yeah. Fun stuff. It's very silly. Uh, yeah, you have a little training area. This is a lot more fun to play around with. Oh, that's right. Um, I remember that I need to unlock my circuits because they're not... They got reset. Uh... Skip that. And then eventually you get this guy who will sell you something that lets you reset those. But okay. it requires it requires in-game material to get, so not important now. And then we have this down here. Honey. Oh, sorry. I was Please texting. put your phone down. Sorry, no, I was texting some so I was writing that down about oh, okay. making a note. That's all. Okay. Sorry. So I missed what you said. Mm, I'm a seeker in my dojo. <laughs> Not ready, you are. Oh, wait, typo. Come back when Not you mastered ready. both heat and cold, you must. Yes, yes. Not ready, I saw nor it. are. Oh. Already, already reported. Okay. I don't know. I don't know any stings. Yeah. <laughs> guy on the bridge. Uh, we're going down here to clean up some quests that are in town and grab some chests that are down here. Oh, I know exactly what you're doing. Hey, girl, check this out. Blink, blink, blink. Sweet moves, huh? Mm. I'm sure you can rock them railings, too. Want to try some moves? Show me your moves. Try to reach some boxes back there without touching the ground. Show me your moves. Just dolly up on the box here and start grinding those rails. What do you say? Ready to style? Ready to style. You bet. Chili dog, show me what you got. <laughs> Let's go. Whee! Ride them rail, Leah. Whee! Killed it. Sweet. You're good. A family just... Come back here to get your award. Yeah, Emily was not going to do that. It's far too silly. Oh, yeah, that was sick, girl. She's like, hi. May your mushrooms always be sautéed and your onions always be grilled. Gravy, girl! <laughs> New quest sounds. Yay! Yeah. There's this in here, which has this little thing in the back. Oh! What the heck? Sacre bleu! I was like, I didn't know this place! Into the ocean? Into the ocean. Is that on purpose? Yes. <laughs> just for weirdness? Just for kicks, I guess. So there's chest up here, some spicy buns in it. Nice. There's one down here. Fruit drink in it. Mm -hmm. These are very these are very tasty things. And this can actually like boost your health at a pinch and Stuff like that, I yep. think, yeah. Uh, yeah, it's all it's all buff related <laughs> stuff, so if you open this up, you can see all this inside of here. Awesome. Um, so they do different is. things. This one increases your attack, this one increases your defense, this increases your focus, this increases your max HP. So a bunch of different kinds of things like that. Um let's see, where are we? Here. All one. hail the ice cream. Want that guy, and then we need. Uh, what have we got map-wise? We haven't visited that little house, which we can. So there's this guy down here. Good day. Do you carry any chance? Uh, by chance, carry any sandwiches? Yep, only two hundred. Two thousand. Blah blah blah. Only 2,500 credits. Should wrap it up for you? 
should wrap it up for Should you? I? I? I've reported these before. Okay, good. 2,500 credits? Uh, I gotta go. Why do they always run away? My wares are top-notch, right? <laughs> uh, make it quick. I'm gonna go close in and head to the bar. Aww. Yes, he's selling very expensive sandwiches. Aww. I'll buy it from you. Oh, well. Oh, was that just a weird joke about him being really, like, expensive? Is that yeah, it? really expensive sandwiches. Uh, we need to do this guy. You know what's also sad? What's up? That guy that sells the sandwiches is programmed to fail. I know, he's not, he's, he's not even a real person. He's an NPC. That's really sad. Mm. Whoa! Huh. Oh, dear. Hi. Didn't your father tell you not to startle people? Mm -mm. Well, he clearly should have. Kids these days don't know their manners. He's a lion! Oh, no, no, don't be sad, young lady. Oh. And at least you look like you're actually sorry. Mm. Uh, now that's better. Hmm. Hmm. I think I like your attitude. Look, if you want to make up for startling me, why not help me out? Hmm? Now, don't look at me like that. It's not hard at all. All I want you to do is find me a broken gauntlet. Simple enough, right? Is he liking all the things? Like, he's got all the shapes on him. Yeah, he does. Weird, huh? Oh, you find a weird player wearing armor from all the classes trying to find a broken gauntlet. What do you know? <laughs> I guess they changed this. This used to be a broken chakram, I think. Oh. What is a chakram? Like a, a ring. <sighs> it's a type of... Open. Anyway. <sighs> uh, very good. Someone told me it was hidden in Autumn's Rise. Apparently, there's an area where you have to defeat lots of hedgehogs while it's raining. You think you can find it? <clears throat> good to hear, but don't keep me waiting, alright? <sighs> so who the heck is that? Uh, he Why will introduce he himself man? later. He's lying, though. Oh, he's lying. No. I man, just now. He looked like he was wearing gear from each class. Yeah. yeah. Normally, that should not be possible. I wonder how he managed to sneak this past the developers. Who's saying he's a player? Hmm. Well, he looks like he's someone playing. And he's wearing all the player stuff. He's wearing all the player stuff. Now we need to get this quest. I like the way that she runs, it's so cute. Ah, a seeker graces the plain old city guard with her presence. Got some time off from solving ancient mysteries, do you? Mm. Well, we could also use some help here in the city. One of our watchmen at the market called for reinforcements a moment ago. None of those fancy track-walking adventures, I suppose, but matters of inner security are not to be taken lightly either, yes? Why are you talking down to her, dear? That's just his character. They're, they're, they're mm. game characters. <laughs> No, that's how they're written. Okay. It's good to see a young seeker recognize the importance of even mundane tasks. <laughs> you can find the garden question in the central area of the marketplace, near the seeker hub. Ask her about the problem and solve the case. Mm-mm. So... Uh, the factions of Ricky Harper. We're gonna do that one, we're gonna do that one. These guys are gonna wait until later. La la la... So, we can go ahead and get started on this quest. Um, excuse me, I was going to say, I don't know how long it's going to take to do, like, various things. Uh, once once these actually get going, and especially if you know where you need to go, they actually aren't that, that long. We'll go talk to this guy first. You visited all the factions in Ricky Harbor. Excellent. I hope you now understand how you can help humanity, besides solving the track of the ancients. And remember that they might have new tasks available for you as time goes on. So you should return and offer your help as you progress further. Yay! But for now, take these rewards as a gesture from the United Voyager Nation. Mm. Hooray! So there's that. And then we will go talk to this lady. Who's this lady? Oh, good day, Seeker. Are you the reinforcements I was promised? Is that a good voice? Sure. Mm. Finally! We've got some really pesky thieves at the market lately, stealing from both the stands and customers. I just saw one committing theft of the stands of, bleh, of the stands, but he was gone before I could catch him. I have to remain here and keep watch. It's up to you to catch him, understand? Mm. 
Great. I saw him running towards a small park in the southeast. So go and get that crook. I think I know what quest this is, because I think it had funny, like, responses or something. Yeah. I, I think. These, I don't are, these know. are all funny quests. I know. But I remember you showed this one to me specifically before. Yeah. Yes! Shady Shorsh. Shady Shorsh. Hi. What do you want from me? Hi, Leah. Hi. I... I see. So you want to arrest me for my crimes. <laughs> All right. It was only a matter of time, but <laughs> I just had to earn money somehow for, for... Here, let me show you. This is exactly what I thought. My dashing behind! Bye! <laughs> ah! It seems like they still have not given those average question PCs more nuanced responses. <laughs> <sighs> well, that is good news for us. I know. Otherwise, doing side quests might be problematic with your limited means of communication. <laughs> mm. Yes, I'm sorry. I will continue working on it now. She's like, that's not my fault. <laughs> Young people these days have no manners. Running through the streets like they're fleeing from the police without regard for others. Oh, huh. Mr. Brittle. <laughs> All right. <laughs> these are great. Hi. Hello, young lady. Did you also see that untempt ruffian running through the street like a madman? He was stinking of smoke and looked very suspicious, I tell you. Ooh. I saw him running to the southwest to a dead end by the sea if you want to teach him a lesson. <laughs> stinking of smoke. Is he smoking? Well, he, like, tossed a smoke bomb. Oh. Hi. Yulian. Mm-hmm. Okay, I guess that's the end of the line, then. It's really a shame oh, that you're so slow! Bye! Yeah! <laughs> find out where the thief went. Again. That's great. Also, we will find these... What's that? This is a locked chest. <gasps> it requires a key. So one of the things I like to do uh, in these cases is... Um, make notes using stamps of where those are oh, so that I know to come wow. back to those later. So, you know what? I feel like you haven't shown me this before either, so I am genuinely you know. impressed and like excited you know. to see all so, this So, yes, stuff. I highly recommend doing that yourself. Yes. Uh, if you ever find a chest that you don't know how to reach or if need something to come back to later. You want to remember where it is again. So we run back up here. That yeah, mean scoundrel ran past here. You must have given him a solid spanking. Good job. <laughs> uh, still not satisfied? Well, he ran toward Autumn's Rise if you want to whip him some more. Mm. Leah loves whipping. Leah loves the whip. And <laughs> <laughs> uh, we got this guy who offers some equipment. All right, so I think mm -hmm. I think we've done everything that is easy he to do. He said that guy. Yeah, oh, he's outside. Him? He ran, find the thief out in Autumn's Rise. So it's about time for us to leave. It's so funny, because there was another NPC that just mm. walked by over, like, on the right side of the screen. Oh, okay. It looked just like him, and I was like, wait, what just happened? And we'll accept this guy's quest. Humble helper. Hi. Hello, Miss Seeker. So great to see you here on Shadoon. As a humble part of our endeavor here, I'm trying my best to aid Seekers. Ooh. But my skills are just not on the same level as yours are. Might I ask you to help me out, dear Seeker? Ooh. He wants us to kill some hedgehogs. Aww. Superb! Come back to me when you defeated the hedgehogs. <laughs> we can do that. Kill the hedgehogs. Mark that one up, too. Now, can people click on these things to do quests? Let's see how those hedgehogs would fail. I feel weird asking a question while you're fighting, but mostly I'm wondering. So, I don't know if you noticed there that I pulled off a nice counter on those guys, Ooh. which is something that you can do with the right timing. Well done. Laser bridge! <laughs> Hello, Emily. So, are you able to use, like, mouse controls? Or I see you using key commands to hit to, like, select menu items and stuff. Uh, like, somewhat. strokes and stuff. Whoa! So, we got Hillcats, too. Yay, it's got headphones! 
Is it like a meerkat with headphones? Yeah, we're gonna take a break here. Anyway, everything ready. Now we need someone to... Oh! Why, hello, Seeker. <laughs> Hi! Well, very fortunate. I just finished my preparations. And even found the exact kind of Seeker I was looking for. Seeker, I, I'm in desperate in need of help. Huh? Yes. Yes. Oh, boy. Wait, you're still here? Huh? Mm -hmm. That is most unexpected, I must <laughs> say. Do you scare everyone off? People of the nether choose to ignore me. I don't suppose you would like to help me? Mm. Really? Splendid! <laughs> okay, let me introduce myself first. I'm Henry. Henry the Researcher. <laughs> I study this fine moon's flora and fauna. Uh, what is your name? Leah. Uh, fine name. Fine name indeed. I will remember, remember it. <laughs> hmm. You Get see, blush. I, I want to gather some d data for Autumn's Rise, but it seems I can't alone gather everything I want. The track of the ancients only allows seekers to find certain things. Huh? Like compiled a list of things I need. First, I need some items and information the local wildlife. Additionally, I need a list of all the landmarks in this area. And finally, I need you to retrieve a probe I installed further ahead. I would be honored if you would help me gather all the intel. Nice. Aww. Yeah, that's better. Wow. Gotta do a lot of things. Please find out what you can and return to me. Mm. Thank you so much for your help. And in case you were wondering what the probe looks like, it looks the same as the ones next to me. <laughs> so, that's Aww, Henry. That's Henry. You do that very well. It's kind of you, you do that very adorably. Throw those in there, just yep. so that we can complete them as we go. Nice. Hey, look who it is. Hi. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Help me. Mm. So the hedgehogs trapped him? Apparently. Ah. Boom. He's still there, huh? Yep. Okay. Hi. I, I'm so sorry, for real this time. Mm -hmm. I, I'm serious, I'm out of smoke bombs anyway, otherwise those damn hedgehogs would never have gotten me. <sighs> but maybe they've been sent by the track to show me the error of my ways. This time, I will turn myself in and atone for my crimes, truly. Mm -hmm. So, if you'll excuse me... Oh, but you're coming with me. But, but I was going to come anyway. Uh, don't you trust me? Sorry, pal. Trust is nice and all, but I won't take any more risks with you. Uh, all right, all right, jeez. <laughs> In any case, thanks, girl. You did great work here. Report back to the chief to get your reward. Mm. All right, off we go. I didn't forget my voice for her. Eh, that's about right. Doesn't matter <laughs> too much. She's a pretty incidental character. <laughs> Spheromancer? Not something I see very often these days. Hmm? You see, the class is very hard to master, so it became a bit unpopular, I would say. And nowadays, you only find a handful of people trying to play it. Hmm. Random plays. Just saying random stuff. No. You say there's a blue-haired hedgehog that drops hot dogs around here somewhere, isn't Somewhere there? around here there is. That's amazing! Very good use. Ooh. So I'll pick those guys up. Mm -hmm. I'm so glad they have like an auto grab for all the stuff yeah. that you drop. Did they change the the gathering sound? Uh, probably a little bit. Instead of a plunk, it was something else. Took those guys by surprise. Pick 
ten hedgehogs defeated. Yay, well done. Easy enough. So yeah, we're going to collect some chests up here. Uh, and that's some of the stuff you need to collect. Yeah, just paging through what we've got. we got to get some hill cats taken care of, which is fine. That's I got one, I think. Old oh. hedgehog. I love little DJ head, DJ hill cats. They're so cute. If they ever sell like figures or something of those, I would totally consider getting one. You ever wonder what kind of music those things are listening to? Yes. They seem very much into it, no? I'm gonna say Skrillex. What do you think? <laughs> really, what do you think? What do you imagine them listening to? Something like that. Sounds, sounds about right. <laughs> so, yeah, we got those guys taken care of. Yeah, we get a level. Yay! Maybe more like Hillex. <laughs> oh, that was terrible. That was pretty terrible. <laughs> You're uh, welcome. Let's see. Report back, report back, various things. One of the few, one of the many services I offer is the bad puns. Also, I want to make sure that I'm picking up a uh, various number of plants as I go. I can't go this way yet. Mm -hmm. Oh. Yo, what's up? If you want to pass this barrier, you first have to collect the red flame shade. Get it at the end of the Fadro Temple, right after the boss battle. In case you already beat the boss, just go to the final room and fetch your reward. It should still be there. Okay, thank you. That was very important. Ooh, square, square shrub right there. What are you talking about? That, that's totally normal. That's a totally normal tree. What? No. You're doing that thing with your face that you do when you think it's funny. Because <laughs> yeah, I do think it's funny. <laughs> square <laughs> shrub! It's a perfectly normal tree. I don't know what you're talking about. Whatever. I'm not gonna argue this with you. If I start going crazy on the on the stream, it's not good. <laughs> so. Why is that there though? This? That a perfectly normal tree. Why is the perfectly why normal is tree it, there? <laughs> why is it right there? I don't know. It's just it's just there. You know, being a tree. Being a perfectly why is, normal why is, tree. Why is any tree there? I mean. It's... <laughs> 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 oh, you. I like it, though. This is kind of a running joke from the developers. What? So what? They, like, they just put it there, and it's oh, just... Oh, the really square tree is just and there, And it's just, okay. you know, that's... It's, it's perfectly normal. I don't know why everyone keeps saying Oh, is that what they, they say that, too? Yeah. Aw, that's awesome. Sorry, I hope you guys aren't hearing eating noises. I am eating. I think it's fine. All right, so we got that taken care of. We got a couple of other. Hi, Henry. Quests. You're weird, but we like you. Let me, uh, let me try to get some more of these plants up here. I'm trying to get some of the uh, the bear cicadas. What are those like? Blue-haired spheromancer. Oh no. So we meet again! No, not this guy. Oh, no. Yeah, not this guy again. Yeah, that's what I said. Hi! Good. I see our level is now in an acceptable range. Really? As if that one level would have made a big difference. However, your previous actions have not been forgotten. Being a cheater is bad as it is. But seeing a spheromancer displaying such dishonest behavior, it breaks my heart! I mean, are you a spheromancer too? What? We spearmancers are a noble yet unappreciated class. Oh, he is. I can't allow a player like you to further damage our reputation. Wait, do you have a spearmancer too? Why, of course. Don't you see my striking crimson outfit? Oh! Hold on, I thought you were a tribe leader with all that green and pointy hair. It's my style. It's plain to see that fashion is beyond your grasp. Sure. Anyway, I'm talking to you, blue haired spearmancer. Leah. I challenge you to a duel! Yeah? Hmm. Wait, what? Come on, we just started playing! Of course, we won't do it right here and now. Let's have our duel at the entrance of Bergen Trail. <laughs> I'll test your skills properly to make sure you don't use any more dishonest methods. 
Are you serious? Do you accept Blue Haired Sphere of Answer? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> she didn't say yes. Excuse me. Good. I'll be waiting for you. I just felt like I should say nods. It sounded wrong. And off he goes again. Are you sure it's okay to just accept his challenge like that? Mm. Daco, it's your choice. So let's make sure you're well prepared. I want you to kick this guy's derriere. Come on, let's train. <laughs> Yay. By the way, I haven't pointed this out yet, but... Uh, There's the a track... square tree in the middle of the... No, <laughs> not that. I was going to point out that the um, the track in the background is new. Hmm. This is, this is new music for the area. It used to be a bit shorter. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, but I really like it. It's super great. Cool. Oh, yeah, it's a little flowier. The staccato in places. Yep. So we're going to take a short loop and then come back for the rest of this stuff after we've turned in some quests. Uh, so we go through here. We're just going to make sure that we collect all the various chests that are in the area. So. I'm not necessarily calling all these out as I get them. It's just sort of assume that as you're watching, you'll you'll pick up where I'm going and go. how to get those <laughs> things and so on and so forth. I'm also not really trying to do a lot of combat right now. Oh, and here's one of those trees, Hi, by the way. Hey, how can you tell? Uh, they're kind of glowy. I'll point out the next one. Glowy, huh? Yeah, they're kind of glowy. Um, so there are a couple of ways that you can you can find the find the trees apart from knowing where they are. You see that they kind of glow like this. Kind of glow. Don't you see how the colors on this are oh, shifting? Oh, um, yeah. I the other thing the other, thing, the the other thing that you can do, and this is what the game means by using your secret instincts, is to uh, pull out the analyzer, and this will point out things in the map. That this is a sick tree. That's useful. Um, and I believe. Uh, find the probe, defeat enemies, kill the four sick trees. And this actually tells you which areas they're located on, too. So you can say, all right, here's Pathway 3, here's Obelisk Lake, there's one in Pathway 2, there's one uh, off-road 2. Um, so they're all around in this area, and if you get up close to them, it'll tell you that they're there, etc. Yay, we cured the sickness. Um, Landmark down here. The six trees are subtle, but I bet you know. Whoa! There's one of them buffaloes with, the, one of them buffaloes. with like the metal head again. Uh, it's like an armored bison think, or something. I think you're on my list. Sure, let's let's mix it up. It's a mad bovine, right? That's what a mad bovine is, I think. Yes. Fun that you have the NPC that you have your other characters just fighting with you. I really like that actually. Come on, Emily, you know better than that. Well, actually, she doesn't yet. <laughs> oh, really? What do you mean? Huh, did we just pick up a cow with some kind of iron mask? <laughs> yes, we used to have cows in the neighborhood when I was a child. <laughs> a moose bit my sister once. <laughs> 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 I don't know why that made me think of that. No, no really. <laughs> <laughs> the commentators responsible for this stream have been sacked. <laughs> hey, you can't sack me. I'm your wife. But after what you just said, I don't think I want to be that anymore. <laughs> this, by the way, is a good piece of equipment. Oh. Uh, pick up. It's a nice level 11 piece of equipment versus some of the, the early stuff that you've got there. That gown. So, worth picking up. And also, this is new. Mm -hmm. Whoa. Yeah, we 
can't do anything from this side yet. Um, but this is a new cave. Oh yeah. Uh oh. This is this is always hilarious to me. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, what just happened? <laughs> yeah. Does that happen uh, to everybody when if that happens? Yeah, there's a that's um a pathing and a spawning issue. That's funny. I really I really want to leave that in there for at least a few cases because the uh, the response to it from the um, from the party members is, is always hilarious. I know, it's like what? Uh, like what? Well, what, did I what just... is going on? Yeah, that's so weird. Um, Ooh, loose rock. Loose rock. Is that new? No, that's uh that's the other quest. Remember Tukos? Whoa. We didn't ask for this battle, or did we? No, I don't know, do you? That's not just annoying. I think we need to actually beat this guy first. You're still cute, actually. Big job. There we go. Mo 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 multi kill. There we go. I don't know if that's from, so. I don't know. Some first person shooter. <laughs> Probably. Fun back in Z day. So, we're gonna Sounds head good. back this way. What are you doing? <laughs> Talk so. to you. Wow, Miss Seeker, you really did it. Here's your rewards. <gasps> Yay! Edge wall. And grass walkers. Ready for another quest? I even have more equipment as a reward. Ooh. Yes, he does. By hitting plants. Happy collecting, and remember that different plants yield different items. Okay. We've already done all that. Ooh. Well, Miss Seeker, you really did it. Here's your rewards for it. Oh my gosh, that's funny. That always cracks me up yeah. when that happens, where it's like, oh. You might as well just throw all this stuff on here. Edge of wall. Just to boost our level a bit, and since we're at level 5, let's go ahead and throw another modifier on there. Nice. I'm glad you know what that means, because I should yep. So let's head dun, back in dun, here. Dun, 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 dun. I already got the report. You did a fine job out there for a rookie. Hey, that was pretty good for Rambo. <laughs> <laughs> in any case, you are welcome to help us out again in the future. The rookie harbor guard is always busy. Fine. Yay! Level up. Level up. Does Emily level up with you too? She does. Okay. Yeah, she gains experience as well. Uh, well we I really can... want to see her a little excited. Yeah, she's. Uh, looks like she's level five. We're still about a level Great. ahead of her thanks to that crab. That crab. I really want to see her excited little level up. I know that would be so cute. I know. She doesn't do it though. No. Oh. Ever. Ever. No, it's just Leah who does that. Well, you know. All right. If I've been hitting enough plants. I should. Hitting enough plants. That sounds like a euphemism for something. Have enough <laughs> for two of those, <laughs> and two of those, and one of those. So we've got those trade items, so we will be able to turn those in. Uh, Hitting enough plants. Alright, let's talk to Manzana. Yes. Ah, you're done. Wonderful. 
your effort should have quenched the threat to Autumn's rise. You have our deepest thanks. May we continue to preserve the harmony on this moon together. Yay! Ooh, I'll be right back. Hold All right. I'm just going to adjust the thermostat. All right. Retrieving the data went off without a hitch. Mm. Great job. Hopefully that will stop Tuco's from mumping around. He's a great scout when he's in a reckless airhead and he shouldn't be down over some late mister. Anyway, take this reward. I hope to see you around for future endeavors or quality time. <laughs> She's totally coming on to us. Okay. We actually can throw this guy on here. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. Let's see. Uh, I don't need to get on there. Um, it's interesting that life bars go over top of everything, which is not a bad idea, but it's just funny. Oh, like for Emily? Yeah. It's mostly so that you can track her even if she goes behind stuff. No, I think that's a good idea. Um, it's just funny. I think you can bad. actually turn that off if you want. I mean, you don't have to. But. It's not that important, but there's actually a lot of oh yeah, may as well show this off in the you interface can. for where you get updated from things. Ooh, that's very useful. Let's see, party status bars, all all but Leah. Um, mm. So I think if I turn that off, yeah. Oh so yeah. That will well, you can turn put it back on whatever you want. Um, or yeah. Yeah. Uh, and you can put one on Leah. Okay, what languages do they have? They have, currently, uh, where do we have that? Ah. Oh, there it is. Okay, general languages. So we have English, okay. German, Chinese, Japanese, and Korean. All of those will be in the game That's in really full cool. on release. And then more will probably Whoa. be added um, afterwards uh, through community help. Wow, that's uh, awesome. But they have partners for, for all of the Asian languages uh, wow. who have helped them keep the game translated fully. That's so. great. So, yeah, very cool. Oh, that's um, really cool. We go down here. Mm -mm. We go down to the pub. Talk to this lady. Ah, finally, another seeker visiting my humble establishment. Are you the one with the new supplies? Miss Kiwa. About time that Mr. Namjoon promised me those ingredients hours ago. Makes me wonder why we even pay fancy paper pushers like him. We're just doing for just doing some calls anyway. Next time I might just contact those doing the real work myself. <laughs> anyway, I'll send him a confirmation about the job. You better go back to him to get your reward. All Be set. in the middle, man. Ain't got no respect. Ain't got no respect. I really love Emily's little pseudo tail. Yeah, it's cute. It's so freaking cute. What do they call a little wisp of hair that pops up from top of her head? The the ahoge? Yes, which means what again? Uh, like idiot hair. <laughs> <laughs> not an idiot. Sorry, Emily. You're not an idiot, Emily. Don't you listen. Don't you she, listen to anything. She is kind of dense. Let's be fair. What? She, I haven't seen enough of the game, I guess. Do you know how long it takes for her to figure out that Leah can't talk? <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Never mind. She still doesn't know now. Well, obviously. And she is the yeah. last to figure it out. Oh, it's true. I've already gotten the message from our satisfied customer. Good job. Here's your payment. I hope I can count on your future assistance. 200 rupees. No. <laughs> yes! Wow, that was quick leveling. Yep, I feel like uh, we just quest. Did that. So, uh, you know, pro tip uh, quests are one of the fastest ways to level. Mm -hmm. um, they're, they're a really easy way to get a couple levels worth of experience every, every major milestone of the game because there's always new quests. So, if you keep doing the quests, you pretty much don't have to grind. Um, that, and that's never a bad thing. Yeah. 
Because grinding is not always very fun for some people. Yeah, I mean, it's up to you. I think the combat's super fun, but I actually avoid it uh, early on just so that I don't, you know, get out of range of where the quests are fun to do. Because um, you can definitely be overleveled for quests, and then they become really easy. Yes. Uh, uh, what was I going to do? I was... What are you going to do? I don't recall. I am level 7, so let me throw melee on here. And I think I can tackle um, this hedgehog. Now this might be... Oh, can I ask you a question? Yeah. Um, I'm a super noob when it yeah. comes to this kind of thing. So how on earth do you keep track of all of like, the things you're upgrading for yourself? Or like the paths you go down? And, like like this, the circuit stuff? Yeah. Mostly because it's like... Does it make it really complicated to integrate um, all of them into the system? Or... Like, um, into the gameplay, like, controls and everything? Not really. That's always so, something I worry about. So, no, we can take a moment to talk about that. So, um, here, in the circuitry, most of this is passives. So, really? we've got stuff that increases my attack, this increases my melee attack specifically, uh, this is just my general attack, uh, and then you have the occasional act of art, and this is something that I can do hmm. while fighting through a special key. So the combat system is relatively simple. Um, you only got, have a few slots, I guess? You, or? Yeah, I mean, there's... there's, It works by variegating um, a bunch of... or a small number of simple actions uh, through context. Mm -hmm. So, uh, if I left-click, because I use a mouse and keyboard, um, if I click near myself, I'm going to do a, a melee attack. Uh, and that can be bound to a button, but I don't play that way, so... Um, but you, but now you know if, but, you're, yeah. if you're a button guy. If you're a button guy. Or girl. Yeah. Or, you know, anything else. Yeah. <laughs> and then also, if I, um, if I click somewhere farther out, well, then I'll start aiming and I can shoot uh, projectiles. Mm -hmm. So you can see that the transition point is right around here. And if I click inside myself, I get a little ring that shows me where that is. Mm -hmm. um, and you can, you can click like this, but your aim is a little wonky until you've done that for a while. So generally speaking, you want to line it up first. You can hold it down, shoot a charged ball, uh, and then you can do really fast for smaller balls. Balls that are charged, bounce off of things, etc. And all that is just with one button based on the context. Um, likewise, you have a shield and a dash. So if I'm moving around and I right click, I'm going to dash. If I'm standing still, I'm going to guard. Oh. And based on where I put my mouse, that's where the shield goes. Um, uh, then you have a special, and so the special is bound to spacebar. So depending on what action I'm performing, if I'm doing a melee attack, or if I'm not doing anything at all, my special is going to be my melee. Uh, I don't have anything else unlocked at the moment, but if I was aiming and hit the special, and I had a throw art, then I would do that. If I was guarding, I would do a guard special. If I was dashing, I would do a dash special, and we'll see more of those later. Okay. So, anyway, that's the that's the basics of the combat system. Um, and then you get into different elements a little later down the road, and those change up your skill set entirely. Okay. Um, so you can switch between those. And the idea is that you actually have just a fantastic wealth of options, but they're all really easy to access. And so it doesn't feel like super overwhelming. You're not trying to remember 20 different buttons. There's like only only a small handful of of specific actions that you perform. That's it's awesome. all about how you perform them and what which modes you're in when you do it. And what you kind of select is the stuff you want yeah. to do. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Okay. That's good. That's something that's always confused me. So I'm yeah. glad that it's in practice it's not actually that confusing. Yeah, the game is is really easy to to get into. That's really awesome. That's been my impression. I always worry about that with like massive actual other RPGs with like just tons of combos and stuff like that. Even fighting yeah. games for me, that always was just like, wait, I'm just a consummate button masher. So, ooh, that's a red head hedgehog. Yep. Come on, Emily. Emily, you get. Ah, you're supposed to fight that for me. What? Oh. She, she broke off attack on it. Do they have, um, when you leave... Oh, yeah, okay, so I was wondering. 
you need to exit a fight kind of yeah. thing. Yeah, I'm trying to take on some of these guys. So I think I... I think I need to get some... Yeah, I, I need to get, get these guys taken care of. Whoa! He's wet in the water. That's one way to get rid of Just drown it into submission. <laughs> So yeah, as you as you get used to the combat, like I don't know, this all feels super natural to me. So I'm just kind of used to how it works. But I, I don't think it's that. Yeah, that I bet if I played, it. then you'd have to dissect it a bit more. But it's okay. Yeah. That's why I all make right. these videos. You can share your knowledge with people that are trying to learn. Yeah, uh, back off some of this. So yeah, here. If you remember that weird guy with all the uh, armor talking about mm, mm -hmm. finding a place where it's raining and there are a bunch of these guys, oh, yeah. uh, that's what this place is. So, mm. first... The famed ever-raining Valley of the Hedgehead. Is that blue one is? Or no? Yes, but first we need to get rid of all of these guys. Yeah, something else that's important about this um, is that as you fight stuff, uh, you increase your combat rank. So that's what Emily was reacting to there. Oh, so she, she actually had some comment when something happened. Um, was that... Oh, yeah, you just keep going. Let's go ahead and give us a chance to heal. Yay. Oh boy. Static! Oh, it's a totally copyright, non-infringing blue hedgehog. This is it's definitely not... It's not a hedgehog either, it's a hedgehog. It's a hedgehog. It's, you know, it's trademark free. It's got free. red eyes. It might have blue quills, but, I mean, it's got four legs. And it may be really fast, but you know, it doesn't have like a sidekick or anything. Ugh, I couldn't handle this. I love when they drop out. They have the little things. I wish I could see a close up of his of the little head tag sprite. Oh, oh snap! Yeah, he hits hard. So. Hell, don't. That was just yeah, too much try that again. Handle. Wait, let's do all yeah, this Yeah, I have to do all this again. Ugh. Maybe we should cut it out. No. Okay. <laughs> but I will I will do a safety this next time. Okay. It's also worth noting that I am taking this guy on early. Mm -hmm. Like, this is a... He's a level 15 um, monster. Mm-hmm. So. I wonder what Sergey is doing right now. Just drinking coffee, maybe playing some solitaire. go. Mm -hmm. So yeah, powering through that. But yes, I'm going to go ahead and take a safety here uh -huh. and come back in there. Uh, yeah. uh, leaving the screen essentially saves your game. Mm -hmm. 
that's what it does. So if you ever want to save your game really quickly, uh, or save your progress if you uh, were to get knocked out by an enemy like this, you know, particularly tough fight here, um, you can essentially do a quick save on your progress. by uh, leaving the screen. So would you advise people to not fight him at the level you're fighting I, him at? I would advise players who are not fairly well advanced at the game to uh, maybe maybe get a few more levels on it. Damage, yeah. a battle, and you're good to go. I feel like those are the items you use the most, really. Yeah. Corner that sunshine. I love the sound effect. That just sounds like it's hitting you with so much weight when it lands, you know? It just sounds like it would hurt. Oh, Ooh, that was close, babe. What are you gonna do? If it's like, oh, oh my gosh, this is. How are we doing? Okay. Oh my gosh, he just goes like a cannonball. He can really move. He's got an attitude. Yep. I don't know if I'd say he's the best thing alive, but gosh dang. Oh, I'm back to kick some gear. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, um, um, thank you, Amelie. That thing's scary. Where's Robotnik when you need him? Ow! Sandwich. Myself up here. Sandwich. Oh, jeez. Okay, kids. So this is why. You no. Know, Uncle Jimmy's very ambitious, or Uncle Wervin's very yes, ambitious. Yes, I am very, very ambitious. Alright, uh, let's do this guy They give just water, that's great. Also, do they kill you while you're replenishing? Like, can they attack you? It is. Oh, jeez. Oh, god. Yeah, you were distracting me. Ugh, fine, I don't want to talk to you. Okay, well, while we're here. Yes. Can they kill you? Yes, during... they can. Okay, that's not fair. Yeah. Alright, one more try. I will, I'm gonna, I'll see you guys a little later while I let him finish his fight.
one of those in there. Uh, tackling something a little bit tougher before you're really supposed to do it. <laughs> Easily gain a level off of that. Um, Yay! Good job. At least you have that, right? Grab a broken gauntlet. There you go. Alright. We are going to take that and quick travel back to Rookie Harbor. So that we can turn that back in. Uh, this way. Welcome back, young lady. Did you find the broken gauntlet yet? Mm. Really? Uh... This is very good. <laughs> I knew I could count on you. Mm. Such a fine young lady with expert listening skills. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks a lot. I even have a little something for you as a reward. Oh, I never asked you for your name. I'm Dakar. Get in Dakar. Leah, hi. You get in the car? <laughs> I, know, I never thought of it like that. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder. I they, wonder did if they that's mean what it that way? Is. Did they mean that way? Get in Dakar. <laughs> no, that's not creepy at all. <laughs> Get in the car. Uh, I'm gonna ask him about that. Oh my god. Well, I'm not long. I'm not good with long goodbyes, so let's keep this one short. Bye. <sighs> She's appropriately frustrated and confused. So yeah, there you go. Yay. That good fun job. thing. He doesn't give you much for it, actually, but it starts an important quest line. He does. Yep. So let's see, how are we doing? We need a little bit more than that department. A little more what? A little bit more collectible-wise. Okay. So that's about all we have for quests in this area, which are going to sort themselves out pretty naturally. Um, I'm going to show this, but of course we can't get to this chest yet. I really want that treasure. <laughs> Will you give up already? <laughs> We're clearly missing some key item here. They do that to promote backtracking to previous areas. <laughs> Content is totally worth it. I hope so. I really like that that particular sprite with the person with their head tilted, leaning on yeah. their hand. It's really cute. So I want one done of me like that. Loop like that. Like I really want one of me done like that. It's really cute. Well, I think we can probably do that, honestly, because we can you can design your own. Oh yes. Avatar for this one. 
we get that uh, backer reward. <sighs> hmm, hope we don't get lost around here. Oh, over here. Over there, sorry. I just noticed there is a hill cap with red headphones. Cool. Yes. Excuse me, I have to head northwest to reach Bevin Trail. Hmm. I hope it's not too far. I will have to log out sooner or later, you see. Hmm. Oh, don't worry, I'll stay up until you beat Mr. Grasshead. And please don't hurry too much because of me. We have to make sure you're well trained, no? Hmm. Alright then. Say bye, Pete. I don't know what that means, actually. Let's go. Oh. Hmm, that is right. We've been playing for a long while now, Leah. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I suppose there is still time for them to face the duel. Mm. Come on, Leah! Aww. They're both so freaking They cute. are. <laughs> they They're are right. wonderful characters. They're good, sweet friends. Mm -hmm. I love it. Off, yep, gotta gotta always look out for trick shots. Wow. And sometimes they're just out in the open to take off. So here's the other side of that new cave. Ooh, so cool. Let's see. Is it a puzzle cave? It is a puzzle cave. You figured out how to do it yet? Uh, that's right, we need to go down here first. So we need to go around the other side now. Emily's like, Leah, where are you going? So we got that taken care of. Red, there's a red hill, hill cat. There are red hill cats, and they are, they are stronger. Are they like the red hedgehogs? Yeah, they're like the red hedgehogs. They're a little... Same basic enemy, but... You know, stronger, a little bit more aggressive. Okay. We also have... Uh, Black bison Ooh, as well. That's cool. So similar kind of this a is thing. The advanced area, obviously. Whoa! To observe those who seek all elements is our duty. Mm. If you dare to seek our wisdom, then only what is broken can open this door. Ah. Uh, that seems cryptic. Indeed. Yes. It looks like this is actually something that I hadn't seen yet. Um, they've been making small additions. I don't think the observatory is going to be ready for the final version, okay. but from the look of things, this is actually where all of the broken weapons that are oh. part of that quest are going to end up. Nifty. Do you have any? Not yet. Uh, well, you can see this one is kind of glowy. Oh, uh-huh. Because I found the broken gauntlet. Oh, you did. You're right. So, yeah. That's that's kind of cool. It is cool. To see that they're finally kind of deciding what that's going to look like. And this isn't quite version 1.0 yet. No, so and we'll there are going to be things that get added even after 1.0 is out. But, so. you know. 
Where can they go if they have questions after this video? Uh, I would suggest dropping in on the Discord, which is public. It's just discord.gg slash crosscode. Um, and ask any questions ask there. ask any questions there you like. Various chat, I guess, sections. Um, yeah. Everybody is very helpful. Everybody is very friendly. We will be happy to help you. Oh, look at that dude there. What's he doing there? Um... He is, well, he's just chilling out. Is he dead? No, he's not. Emily's just standing over him, just staring at him. <laughs> Suppose, is he dead is kind of a dumb question. No. Um, he's actually part of the Holiday Quest. Um, Ooh, he's part of, like, the or a Holiday Quest? The Holiday Quest. Um, yeah, there's only one. Oh. Uh, I thought I heard you say a, so. A Holiday Quest, yeah. Yeah. A quick teleport over here just to avoid the walk. And we'll come down here and grab this chest. Nice. The Halcyon Droplet. Mm. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, again, with that section. Poor Emily. Oh. oh, look! She got that. These damn bones, they really ain't damaged from my attacks. I told you, throwing balls won't impress them much. You gotta get close in person. Do I look like some brawler to you? Plus, cows scare me. I don't think the bowens care. All they understand is literal ass kicking. I guess I'll need to get used to it. Yikes. Alright. So let's run on through. Basically, just need to collect some more chests. I should also point out that until you've unlocked all of the quests in the area, uh, not all chests are accessible. So, um, even with the ones that we've marked, we are not going to have 100% by the time we've finished going through this area. Okay. We're just going to have close to it. We're almost there. Multicolored fruits in some of these trees. Uh, yeah. What does that mean? Does Nothing. That mean? Just, okay. just ways to make. Don't look interesting. Ways to make things look interesting and not all the same. You said we're almost done. Uh, yeah, we're almost done. Oh. Uh, with this session. Okay. Yeah, I'm basically just running through to collect the last just several those things. Yeah. Several things here. Uh, It's here. Nothing exciting in here yet. Okay. But we'll be back. We shall be back. And then... Across there. Around, around, around here. And I might as well equip that, because that one's nice. Yeah. Daikon. Ooh, fancy, huh? Yeah. Yes, a huge radish that can be both a fearsome weapon and a healthy meal. Ah! Well, good! It's about time the radish diversified. Uh, yeah, I like the daikon, especially early on, because it gives you uh, some HP regen. Okay. Um, yeah. And that's always nice in the fight. That is nice in the fight. Um, I might as well start getting some XP on things. Yes. Because I'm going to want to be a little higher powered by the time we get to a, to the end of this area. And you'll find that leveling is actually not hard to do at all. That's good. Yeah, it didn't seem like it has been for you. Yeah, part of that is the quest, but... Like these, um, these red, um, hillcats here, for example, 
you can see that he gives me 49 XP, which is, you know, a 20th of a level for me right now. Um, so, it's actually not that hard to level uh, up to a certain point. Ooh, um, it's a black one. Don't you, like... Can't you, like, distract them to, like, hit, have them run into, like, a literal wall? Yes, that's the main way to deal with them when you don't have a party member to work with. Come on, Emily, you know better than that. What? I don't know what she's doing. Oh, she's trying to attack him from the side instead of behind him. Mm. He gives me at 125. Cows. I like how she keeps talking about cows. I used to see cows every day on my way to school. After some time, I think they started, started recognizing me. Yes. Aww. I'm glad you have so many good memories about cows, Emily. She's cute. She used to live on a farm. Or at least, like, out in the country or memory after it just like head butted her right into the water <laughs> and then she pops back and it's like I love cows <laughs> yep it's just still adorable I love how she also has these great cow memories yeah let's let's get at least one more of these guys Oh, that was Emily eating a sandwich. Oh, okay. Yeah, your party members will try to get themselves taken care of, too. That's great. Which That's is... a great little thing. Go into the water! Ouch. Oh, and then it... What did you in the water? You were the decoy. It was a bad idea. Alright. And then has a one con. Hey, you're not doing this to, to mess with me, Lee. Hmm. Wait, yes? What do you mean by that? <laughs> yep, I'm just messing with you. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Yeah. Level 9, that's probably pretty good. I don't think we need to get to a 10th level for... Uh, they had a sound effect that was like, poing, every time you collected an item, and um, I kind of miss it. I think I'm going to use that... Yeah, first cut. Because okay. I like first cut. What does that mean? Uh, so that one, let me pull this off one of these guys. That oh, is that art. Is it kind of like giving you, um, I'm thinking about like DD or Pathfinder where it gives you like a thing where you, you hit first? I forget what that's it's called. It's basically a dash through and do a lot of damage to one enemy. Um, it's really useful against the, the cows, actually. Oh. Hey, you. Hi. Hey, I'm one of the testers for this game. Ooh. The devs asked me to test an almost finished new quest type parkour. I'm kind of tired. You just came along, so want to try it out? <gasps> nice. Good to see <laughs> some enthusiasm. All right, get this. You'll start right next to me. When you touch this checkpoint, another will pop up. Your goal is to walk through every marker until you hit the last one. And the last one's over there. Oh, my. It will only appear after you hit the last normal marker. Mm. Yeah, I know. It's more fun that way, right? Well, at least if you like running. Also, if you leave the map, all your progress is lost. Mm. Another bummer, I know. Anyway. Ready to try? Sure. Mm. Awesome. As I said, just start by stepping on the first marker here. Uh, 
it's going to be hard to get those, though. So I won't worry about it. Uh, actually, you know what? We're going to do that in Are you a not second. Doing this I'm, quest? Not, I'm not going to do that quest just yet. I'm going to do that in a second. Um, so we're going to jump over here first. We're going to... Grab those and trigger this, and then. So why are you doing it this way? Well, I'm doing it this way because it's faster. In the long run, this is actually faster to go ahead and collect this stuff, and then because we come back around. And then you do that quest. And then I do that quest on the way back around a second time. Um, so just I don't know if I want to call it speed run. Trick. The speed run is to not do this at all, but. Um, I don't know. It saves a little time um, if you're if you're trying to be 100% completionist to actually just leave that and come back to it, okay. and then you know make your way over here. I actually mean to piss you guys off. That's fine. <laughs> what would it say? Oh, gold beetle. There used to be something interesting in that chest, and now there's not. <laughs> Aww. All right, but yeah, now we can come back here and uh, start this again. Man, that chain sound effect is really nice. And see, now we get to pick this up on the way here and put it on. So by the time we've got out here, we've got some really nice equipment we picked up just through quests and finding chests in the ground. We never really had to buy anything. Um, so tip, don't buy stuff to quests that you're Well, it's, it's, it's the way I play the game. Um, and you'll get, you know, a very specific set of equipment that way. I usually do uh, get some trade equipment um, eventually, but it's very possible. And by the way, here's the pro. Oh, nice. Ultimately, play however you want, but yeah. this is how you like to play. Yeah. It. You know, this is sort of my general route through the game. All right. And that's mm -hmm. done. You did it. Great job. Uh, that was no problem, right? No sudden shocks or anything? Huh? Mm -mm. Great. Uh, great. Thanks a lot. Just take this for your efforts. Mm -hmm. I hope we can meet again. Mm. So you can help me again, you know? Mm. You just want to use me for my skills. Indeed. Yeah. All right. Yeah, we're, yeah, we're getting... Okay. We're, we're almost done. Just a little bit more. So what do we still need to do? Uh, this screen, and then I was gonna talk to the guys up on the next screen. Hey. Oh, wait, is this Southern Girl? This is Southern Girl. Hey, pleased to meet you, girl. Hi. Are y'all interested in plants, too? Hmm? Hmm. They got some mighty strange doohickeys inside, don't you think? Well, I'm... Oh my gosh, why can't Tala you... Tala to lips. Okay. Well, I'm Tala to lips. Oh my gosh. And I've been, I've taken a notion to find and analyze as many as I can. It's so funny when it's written that way. But that's turned out to be a lot harder than I expected. See, getting what's inside seems to be only doable by seekers. I can only collect what they bring me. Ooh. Might y'all be interested in giving me a hand? Yay! Level 50 quest. Ooh. <gasps> hmm. Much obliged, girl. There's, there's my kind. What? That there's oh, my that there's my kind of y'all. It's getting late. First, let me give y'all this here. Ooh. This hand gives me keep up. How to keep track of all your progress? Blah. Can't read. Just keep hitting them plants and analyzing them by getting them doing these. Y'all can check your progress in the menu too. Also. I took the liberty of adding my finds for the alpha Paul plant. 
just keep hitting them plants for me, all right? Mm. All righty, I'll be off exploring for more of them plants. Might even meet you along the way. Once y'all finish, you come find Rick of Harbor Alley Quarters. She has a very fun accent to do. Yep. So, let's see how we're doing on this so far. Looks like we have completed all of it. Yeah. Because I've been diligent doing a lot of stuff. about... Ah, uh, yes. And this is the last landmark. Nice. So, um, we are now that complete. That was very cleanly done. That was all of the quests in this area. Ooh. Handled well, at the same time. So now... Did you do all of them, or was it just some... Um, um, I did all of the quests apart from going back to Henry, which I guess I can do. Uh, I might as well go do that before I finish up here. Which is simple to do, because you get a nice um, ability to you know fast travel. So we'll do that really quick once I've gotten the last chest that's in this area. found all the chests in the area that are possible to get at this point. Oh, good. Um, we have done all the quests that are possible to do at this point, apart from going back and talking to Henry over here, which we'll do right now. Oh, good. And that will wrap us up for this session. Okay. So, hopefully that has given any of you watching uh, some insight on what to do. Welcome back, Leah. Were you able to find all the data I re requested? Oh, marvelous. I d don't know what to say. With this, I might be able to piece together how they made this area. Uh, the ancients, I mean. <laughs> Here, take this. I I I'm looking forward to working with you again. Uh, if you want to, that is. Aw, sure. Get some experience. Nice dude. What are we doing on that? Awkward dude, but nice dude. Uh, let's hop back up here. And let me kill this cow. Let me show this off, because... Yeah. There we go. Ta-da! I thought you were going to get him to run into a wall. No, I was going to show off the dash move, because it works especially well on them. Oh. It gets through their armor really easily. Just to pick up another level. And... Let's see. No, we don't have anything we want to use it on yet. Okay. All right. And we will wrap up on this last little bit of story. Back in Trier, here we are. Next phase of things. So where is Monsieur Grasshead? Let's tell me he's late. Blue-haired Spheromancer! Hey, you gotta have blue hair. Finally, you've arrived. It is time for our duel. As for the location, this place here is just perfect. It is kind of Isn't it kind of crowded here? Why, that's exactly the point. People should witness the grace of the Spheromancer's fighting style. Ooh, I see. Now there's no reason to rush. Prepare yourself and tell me when you're ready to start. And don't even think about chickening out. I don't know, we're going to show you. <laughs> Must I remind you of the definition of a duel? It's Spheromancer versus Spheromancer. No pentavist. Wee oui, wee, oui, I know. This, I'm gonna watch as Leah beats you up. Mm. Anyway, just talk to me when you're ready. 
stomp, 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 yes. stomp. So, that is the perfectly good place to leave it, and Yay. we'll pick it up next We're gonna time kick his butt next with a duel, video. where we destroy him. <laughs> it's it's gonna be sad Yay. how much we destroy him. <laughs> Let's go ahead and pop a save file right there. Alright guys, thanks for sticking with us, and we will be back next time. Hope it was helpful. Good night. Night.